With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. It is given that if the lengths of the tangents drawn from P to the circles this and this are in the ratio 2 is to 1, then the locus of P is. So the circles given to us are, let us say S1, S1 is x squared plus y squared minus 2x plus 4y minus 20 is equal to 0 and the other circle S2 is x squared plus y squared minus 2x minus 8y plus 1 is equal to 0. So these are the two circles given to us. Now we are talking about the locus of point P. So let the coordinates of point P, let the coordinates of point P be equal to h comma k, right? h comma k are the coordinates of point P. Now what we need to do is we need to find the length of the tangents from P to the two circles. The length of tangent from P to S1, this is given by let us say L1, this will be equal to under root of h squared plus k squared, we just simply have to put the value of h comma k into this circle. So we have s squared plus k squared minus 2h plus 4k minus 20. This is the length of the tangent from p to the first circle. Now similarly, length of tangent from p to s2 this time would be let us say given by l2. So l2 would be we now have to put the point in this equation for the second circle. So h squared plus k squared minus 2h minus 8k plus 1. So this is the length of the other tangent. Now it is given that the lengths of the tangents are in the ratio 2 is to 1. Right? So L1 is to L2 is basically given to us as 2 is to 1. L1 is to L2 is equal to 2 is to 1. So let us calculate this. Let us put the values of L1 and L2. So we have, first we can square this. L1 squared is to L2 squared will be equal to 4 is to 1, right? Now we can remove this square root and then simply put the values of the two equations. So now we would have that L1 squared, so that is this. So h squared plus k squared minus 2h plus 4k minus 20. This is L1 squared divided by L2 squared, that is this. h squared plus k squared minus 2h minus 8k plus 1. This is equal to 2 squared by 1 squared, so that is 4 by 1, right? Now let us solve this equation. So we have h squared plus k squared minus 2h plus 4k minus 20 is equal to 4h squared plus 4k squared plus sorry minus 8k minus 8h and then minus 32k plus 4. Now we are going to solve this. Take these h's h squared and k squared to the other side. 3h squared plus 3k squared and then we'll have minus 6h and minus 36k and minus minus plus 24 is equal to 0. So this is the equation. So let us divide everything by 3. So we have h squared plus k squared minus 2h minus 12k plus 8 is equal to 0. So these are the coordinates of p, h and k, right? So the locus of p, locus of p could be found by simply substituting x instead of h and y instead of k. So the locus of p would be the equation x squared plus y squared minus 2x minus 12y plus 8 is equal to 0. And this is the equation of a circle and this is our solution. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.